decide what to do, it's time. How did it do, everybody? Welcome back to Kid Dog TV, and we are here for another unboxing. What did it do? We are finally gonna open up the Turtle Blimp. Me and D got these a while ago. We've had these for a while already. We purchased two, and we just never opened them. So I finally talked Dee into getting me one and to letting me open one for the videos. So we can share with you guys here. The what to do crew. I got you, man. So we're finally gonna open it up. We got it here. Let's check out the box, dude. Just check just the box itself. It's so cool. Just the artwork on it. Look down the back, there you go. Turtle blimp. There you go. It's nice. I like the I like the original turtle blimp stuff here, like the original team mutant turtles. Turtle Blimp, all four of these guys fit on there, let's see them. And they retract down, they repel down. I have all those figures too, so we'll, we'll try them out with this guy too. It's gonna be so cool to open up, man. Open up, it's on our, I don't even know what's sitting here. I never know, like it's such a big box. Oh look, blows up to 30 inches long. Just like me. All right, well, further ado, open this sucker up. Unboxing knife. Let's see, which way do I cut first? I don't even know where to open it from. Let's see, if I were me, open it from this side. Tapes cut. Let's try to save that box if we can. There we go. I get to see what's inside the big old box. In here. What the? What the? Is that a whole lot in here? Here's the blimp. Here's the blimp itself. Ooh, box smells like rubber. Nothing like that Chinese rubber. Get your day started. Look, here we go. Look, this is all that's in here. There's not a whole lot in here. It's like everything's on this piece of cardboard, and then the blimp itself is in here. Kind of exciting for me. I never got one of these when I was a kid either, so I didn't know what it was like to own one of these suckers. There's instructions on how to use the turtle plant. It's everywhere. Ooh, it's a big one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, that smells like rubber already. <laughs> let's see, let's put this down here. Let's cut all these guys out. So let's cut out the actual vehicle itself with the blimp was attached to. Bam! Got that. What a working parts for this, isn't it? And then cut this out. All right. Can you take everything out of there? This is useless. Wait a minute. Second use for it. Buzz Lightyear helmet. For the new movie coming out. Make sure you guys check out the new Buzz Lightyear movie. Please. Let's see what's in these little packets. Let's look at the front wheels. Got the front wheels here. And then the little brackets actually hold the turtles in. You get four of these. Okay, right down. And I don't know where these go, but we'll, find, we'll figure that out soon. Back it is. Oh, there's fins. There's like fins. Where do these go? And there's four of them. Four fins. Let's check it out. All right, and the piece the resistance. The turtle craft. Now, this is not from the original blimp. This is not the original blimp uh, vehicle. I think this is just a, they're used from like a, an earlier version, like a 93 version. This is supposed to be like an 80 something blimp. I don't know. Dino's, she loves this stuff. Oh man, oh, that's what those little cardboard things were. Oh, they held the little guys in there. Oh, that's what it was. So how do you get, how do these guys retract? So what do you do, you just tie it up? Oh, so you gotta do this. All right, I think I got all the uh, little retractable things ready to go. Bing, little dangly, dangly, danglies. And I think these guys go in here. These guys go in there, right there. Push them right in. Oh, there you go. See? 
one there, one there, one on this side, and one on these side. Hang on, you put that there, and the turtles hang off of this little guy right here. Oh, right damn, we'll try them out. We'll go with some of the turtles. Oh, wait a minute, we're missing this too. I put the front wheels on. We got a little back wheel back here. See that? We got these little front wheels. Oh, yeah, there you go. Push it in like this. There you go. And then it goes in like that. Ah, almost there. Oh, look at the back of it, the jetpack. Oh, let's go. Leave out of the place where somebody sit in the front. That's cool. Okay, okay, okay. We got instructions here. Uh, I'm gonna forgo the instructions because this thing's from like the 90s. I don't think we need the instructions. So what's next on the agenda? I heard you have to, what I see from other videos online, people who've already opened theirs. See, let's unfold our blimp. Oh man, look at all the decals. Whew, it smells like rubber. There's somewhere to clip these fins on. The front or the back? I think the back. Ah, oh, yeah, these are little, little nubs. You see the little nubs right there? I think you put your nubs in there. And you got to do it before you inflate this sucker. Or else you won't get them. It'll be a, a bit of a... Meah-each! <laughs> Where are you? A little tough to get in right now. 30 inches long and I couldn't get it in. Oh, this is tough. This is going to be doing the test for me. Oh. Now they got to go all the way in. Got that one in. Hey, they're not that, they're not easy to put in. <laughs> what it do? Oh, I got it in. So watch me bust the proverbial nut right here trying to get these guys on. Oh. Man, they are tough to get in there. The little nubs are like not helping out. Oh, get in there. Use my knife. Oh, it didn't go in. The first one barely went in. I got it in there. The other fin better not be coming out of the point. I'm to put this one in. Got them all on. Got them all on. Now comes the easy part. You gotta fill it for the air. Come on, guys. Blow in there. Cause I, this is gonna be hard for me. I'm old. My lungs ain't as strong as they used to be. Man, it's pretty big. <laughs> it's pretty big. Oh, I'm tired. I'm tired of inflating this thing. Let's hook up the back of this, the back end of this thing. Hopefully, I don't need to do anything else to. Uh, up until I should have done this while it was still deflated. Ah, uh, I think I made a mistake. Okay, after a little deflating and another reflating, be able to put the bottom on. This thing is huge. This thing barely fits on the screen. Can you guys even see me? Oh, what did do, guys? This thing's huge. Oh, man, it's so cool. Look at that. 
that was cool. They had the little retractors. I even brought I brought the brought the figures over. Put them in here to see what the how the holders look. There's two of them right there. Look, they're supposed to fit on the on the blimp. What? That looks so cool. That looks so cool. You can, it, I know it does. It barely does fit on here. Oh wow, that looks cool. Look at that, guys. Let me see. Oh man, look at that. That looks good. So you could put somebody else here on the driver's seat. Who can we put in there? See, they all look really cool just sitting in there. And the blimp. Oh man, it doesn't even fit on my camera. This is so crazy cool. You see that? Mm, it's a zeppelin. Oh, turtle town, bitches. <laughs> and look, they got undercover dining in there. What? That is looks. That is so cool. That is. That is looking really, really cool. I don't even know where I'm gonna display this. I thought I was gonna be able to hang this from my ceiling. And in the in the box it says it has these little like loops here. To be able to put like fishing wire and hang it from your from your ceiling? It doesn't have that. Here, look. Where's the box? I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Look, shows it right there. Right there. Shows the little loop. We try to cover it up with the blows up to 30 inches long. He's trying to strike the brother with sex. You'll see how that is. Wow, this is so cool. Dude, I really like this. Another thing that the original one did have, it has actually wheels that are actually cast. These are actually molded to the plastic, so you know they really don't roll, but still moving around. So pretty cool. Dude, I don't know where I'm gonna put this. I gotta put this over here with my turtle van. Awesome, awesome, awesome item to get. Dude, I can't believe I finally opened it. Dude, this is so cool. But hey, if this is your first time checking out DME and Kidel TV in one of these videos, make sure you subscribe. Subscribe to DME and Kidel TV. Get you notified. Hit that bell whenever we post a new video. But from DME and Kidel TV, we'll see you guys all on the next theme park or unboxing vlog. What it do, guys?